This is the Thank You Ocean Report. Wetlands are among the Earth's most productive ecosystems. They provide water storage, control pollution, protect shorelines, and provide habitat to plants and animals. Wetlands are often referred to as the kidneys of the Earth. Megan Cooper is a project analyst for the California Coastal Conservancy. They are able to filter, clean, and store water that comes off the land, collects in the wetlands, and then it's really filtered and cleaned before it makes its way into the ocean. So they really provide a buffer between the ocean and the land. And that buffer can be very important as coastal communities figure out ways to adapt to the sea level rise that is being predicted. But wetlands have also been viewed as something to be filled, diked, paved over, and there has been a dramatic loss of them. In California, we estimate that we've lost about 90% of the wetlands that existed here before European contact. But now the value of wetlands is being reevaluated, focused on restoring them. If we start to recover some of these wetlands, if we start taking down these levees and removing these constrictions, these wetlands are going to be able to serve that purpose better of really providing a buffer for the land from rising sea levels. And Megan is working on the South San Diego Bay Wetland Restoration Project, where about 70% of the salt marshes there have been lost. One area of South San Diego Bay was cut off from the bay, cut off from that vital tidal action. But in 2011, a number of state, federal agencies, and nonprofits got together and developed a plan to reconnect the South San Diego salt ponds to San Diego Bay. This area is a national wildlife refuge managed by the U.S. Fish and Wildlife Service. What we did was break open large pieces of the levees and reconnect those ponds to the bay. And the impact? has been rapid and profound. The birds, the fish, the animals are flowing back to the restored areas. This area supports hundreds of species of migratory and coastally dependent birds. It's an incredibly important stopover site on the Pacific Flyway. So these migratory birds are making their way north and south. They can stop at the salt ponds area. In addition to having incredible environmental benefits, there are economic benefits as well. The U.S. Fish and Wildlife Service calculated that this $7.7 million project actually generated about $13 million in additional economic output, and it added 130 jobs. And commercial fisheries are being helped because these wetlands are the nurseries for the fish we eat when they mature. So quite a story. My thanks to Megan Cooper. And here's your Thank You Ocean Everyday Action. Visit your local wetlands, see wildlife, go birding, or take a tour to learn more about the important role wetlands play in our ocean and coastal health. I'm Jerry Kay.